What's up guys, this is Square2448 with a Farming Simulator 2015 hauling video and today we will be using this Ram 5500 crew cab with this 50 foot enclosed gooseneck trailer and we'll be hauling these two old cars and this one is a 1967 Impala, it's a two door and this is a 1976 Chevy Nova SS and uh, this shop here polished them and serviced them so uh, we're going to haul him back to the uh, owner's house for him and uh, yeah so we're gonna get loaded up here to start out with the Nova and uh, yeah so I hope you guys enjoy So uh, we're going to load on into this trailer here and uh, yeah this trailer is awesome because uh, you, you really want to haul uh, these nice cars in, in enclosed trailers that way uh, nothing happens and stuff and uh, this car I don't know why but uh, really does not like to uh, go I think it's here we go. I had that problem earlier when I was testing it. It uh did not really want to go up on the truck the first time, but uh, it went up. And uh, this is a pretty cool two-door Impala. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna take these back, like I said, to the uh, owner's house where uh, he's gonna store them. And yes, and a lot of you did ask me to do a hauling video with the uh, Ram 5500 and I did do a mod review on it so that's kinda where you guys saw this truck and uh, yes and uh, this trailer here really needs like a lifted truck because some of the trucks it's slanted down so I thought that this lifted uh, F5 no, but, ah, this Ram 5500 would be perfect for it. So, uh, yeah, so we're gonna get started here on this haul. And, uh, this truck here looks like it's slanted down a little. So it's pretty good suspension, wow. But, uh, it's taking a little to accelerate, which is perfectly fine. So that's pretty realistic right there, that it's taking that extra time to uh, go to the uh, speed that we wanted to and this map is the Manchester map if any of you want to check it out it's a pretty cool map and can be found on American Eagles modding so a uh, pretty cool map but uh, using my turn signals more and more as uh, I try to be as realistic as possible and uh, this trailer is a pretty long trailer and uh, I really liked it in 13 and uh, I, I really do like it it's perfect for hauling cars or hauling even mowers and stuff like that so uh, yeah and uh, this F550 this Ram 5500 was made by a Duramax Nation modder so uh, you guys can check out his channel where he did do a release video on this and it's really cool so I uh, recommend you check this out for yourself and uh, yeah and I want to thank all of you for the amazing support and it's amazing how fast I'm growing and it's all because of you guys so I thank you and I really do appreciate all of you for uh, subscribing, for watching me, and uh, supporting me through my YouTube uh, time here. It's really nice, and I'm excited for what's to come, and uh, there should be a live stream coming up next week, and uh, a lot more coming up in the future now, since uh, I have a lot more time on my hands, but uh, yeah, passing by one of the uh, farms here. And uh, pretty cool, cool farm. Looks like, are the cows moving? 
No, it looks like those cows were just placed there, but uh, I did do a couple of forestry videos on this map and stuff, so let me know if you guys want to see more of that, and if you do, I will uh, make a video on that, and what I like is these Tomiers are perfect for tolling this uh, uh, wide trailer, and I really, really like this setup. The trailer is not slanted down much, and if it is, it's very little. And uh, this truck is towing it like a champ, so that's awesome. And uh, let me know in the comments below on what you guys want me to haul next. And uh, I'm really excited, like I said, for all the new uh, videos coming within the next month. It's amazing. So uh, stay tuned for those. And I'm looking at a building, or I'm trying to, I have a single cab Ram 5500 that you guys have seen, and, I, and I'm looking for a bed for it, I mean, a single cab uh, 5500 would look amazing, so I'm going to see what I can do to uh, maybe take a bed from someplace else and I uh, use it so that would be pretty cool if I could get that to uh, work because like I said I really like the single cabs and uh, crew cabs are awesome but like I said I'm just a fan of the single cabs but uh, yeah so <laughs> we're almost to our destination pretty long haul and uh, this truck is doing an amazing job though really do like the tow mirrors like I said I'm going to probably get them to work here in a little. That way uh, we can use them. But uh, yes. And. Wow. Pretty far distance this was. But uh, yes. And this trailer is awesome. Because it has all the working turn signals. And uh, I really do like it. The door on the side also works. Yes. And the speed limit is 55, but uh, we are nowhere near hitting 55. We're going like 30 tops because uh, this load is so heavy. But uh, yes, we have reached the destination. And let's pull off to the side of the road. And uh, I'm going to show you that door now. This door. This is really cool. It opens. And... Uh, yeah, that's awesome. So yes, let's unlock the load and uh, unload this. And this map is a Canadian map, but uh, it's still fine because it's a really cool map. So uh, yes. Ah, oh, this locking script <laughs> has got me again. Just needed to uh, start it up just and then uh, turn it right off because I uh, don't need to uh, turn it on completely. But uh, don't want to damage these cars since we just got them uh, polished and stuff like that. But uh, we'll drop these off here. And uh, yes, this car is pretty cool here. It's like a fast sports car. Larger tires in the back and that dual exhaust right next to each other is really cool so uh yes so i hope you guys enjoyed let me know in the comments what you thought about this and also please let me know what you guys want me to haul and like always like comment and subscribe